Okay, so hello guys. Um, today I'll be showing the book reviews for one of one of my favorite authors when I was little, <coughs> Geronimo Stilton. So, as you can see, I have quite a lot of the Kingdom of Fantasy books collection. Um, well, I only have one of the normal collection, Four Miles Deep in the Jungle. Well, um, we we'll also see what they're being about. So, hmm. so, Four Miles, who is Geronimo Stilton? That's me, I run the newspaper, but my true passion is writing of adventure stories. Here in New Mars City, the capital of Mars Island, my books are bestsellers. My stories are funny, F famous, famously funny. They are whisker licking good tales, and that's a promise. So that's about Geronimo Stilton. This next paragraph is about the book. So I have I have never been a brave mouse late, but lately my fears were overtaking were taking over my life. So Thea and Trap decided to cure me. They dragged me away on an aeroplane. I'm afraid of flying. All the way to the jungle, oh, oh. there was there I was forced to eat bug soup, climb trees as tall as skyscrapers, swim in raging rivers, and even wrangle snakes. How would I? How would a frail demas like me ever survive? So. That's Four Miles Deep in the Jungle. I think it's an okay book. Uh, they shouldn't prove some things, but can't judge it because it's one of it. It's one of the first books he ever made. It's about the fifth, I think. Okay, so now we'll be starting on the Kingdom of Fantasy collection. I'm only missing a few. But uh, let's start with the ones I have. So, first up is the Kingdom of Fantasy, the first book. This is very good. I like it a lot. I, Geronimo Stilton, never expected to find a, a golden staircase in my attic. But one day I did. At the top of my stairs, there was a door, and beyond the door was a world I never could have imagined, the kingdom of fantasy. I set, I set off in, I set off at, on a, on an incredible adventure to save Queen of the Fairies, the Queen of the Fairies, along. Along the way, I had to face. I had to face giant scorpions, witches, sea serpents, pic, pixies, and 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 dozens of other fanta, fantasy, fantastical creatures. Holy cheese! What a journey! I could wait to get. I would wait. I could wait to get home. To get home so that I could write all about, it, all about it in the book. It, it's full of maps, secret codes, riddles, puzzles, and other amazing discoveries that are made along the way. This book, The Kingdom of Fantasy, it's very good. It's probably like one of the most interesting from. The Kingdom of Fantasy collection. I will definitely get this. Okay.
Okay. So now we'll move on to the other kingdom of fantasy. So the second book is the quest for paradise. Um, okay, so return to the kingdom of fantasy. So let's just see what it's about. Um, this one was not so good as the first one, but it was actually pretty good. Uh, as you probably know, the Kingdom of Fantasy collection has lots of puzzles and things you have to figure out, like code breakers and stuff. So, it's a bit, a bit blurry, you can't really see it, but, okay, so let me start. I, Geronimo Stilton, never expected to return to the Kingdom of Fantasy. But when I received the letter from Blossom, the Queen of Fairies, asking for my help, I had to respond. It turned out the Queen wanted to send me on a great quest to find the Heart of Happiness. But, but first I, I had to find the Map of Paradise. It was just my luck that the map was hidden in the land of the ogres. Holy jeez, I had the most fabulous adventure. Um, yeah, now it's a bit, it's focusing. But, okay, so that's the second book. Now, luckily I have the third and the fourth book without skipping anything. But, then I skip some stuff. Okay, so the third adventure, the amazing voyage. Voyage. Um, this one. Mm, let me just see, cause I read this like very long time ago. Let me try and just flick through and see what it's about. What is it about? Oh wait. Oh, this is the one with the gnomes. So this book, it's. It's super good. I think it's better than the Quest for Paradise, the second one, but not better than the first. Like, first is one of my all-time favorites. So, again, I, Geronimo Stolten, couldn't believe it when I found myself in the Kingdom of Fantasy for the third time. Blossom, the Queen of the Fairies, had been kidnapped. The entire... The entire... The, and the entire kingdom had fallen under an endless freezing winter. Yikes. I had to help. So I en enlisted my friends and we set out on our amazing voyage to a magical talking ship. On a magical talking ship. It, it was up to us to rescue the queen and bring peace to the kingdom. Holy cheese, what an extraordinary quest. Yeah, what's that on the moon? Let me check what it is. Geronimo's third adventure in the kingdom of fantasy. Jeez, we know that already. Said it like a hundred times. Okay, now we will go on to the fourth book. This is the last book um, I have without skipping anything, like any books. So, fought Geronimo Stolten, the Dragon Prophecy. This one, okay, it's, I don't know how to say this. Let me put it in a nice way. It's very bad. So, it's okay, but um, from the books I have, it's probably the worst Kingdom of Fantasy. But it's pretty, it's actually good. But all the Kingdom of Fantasy are good, so this one's a bit less good. Okay, so, 
I, Geronimo Stilton, was astonished to find myself in the kingdom of fantasy for the fourth time. Sterling, the princess of Silver Dragon, needed my help. The latest existing dragon egg had been stolen. If that egg was destroyed, dragons would become extinct forever. I couldn't let that happen. So my friends and I set out to find the egg and restore peace to the kingdom of fantasy. It was truly an amazing adventure. Um, so now I just went on a little break. But, okay, so the next book, um, as... Um, the next book of the Kingdom of Fantasy is the ninth one. Um, not in the collection, but, um, I, I, I don't have the other five books. If I did, I would, I would show it to you. But, yeah, okay, so the ninth book. That's only skipping five. Um, yeah, but that's, um... I have most of them, just five of them. Okay, so anyway, now for the Wizard's Wand review. I think this is a pretty good book. It's actually one of my, it, it is the first Geronimo Stilton book I ever read. It's my, what? I'm not sure if the first book of my, of the Geronimo Stilton, Stilton collection is my favorite, or the ninth. They're both equally good, but um, just if you're wondering what this is, it's an invisible cloak. So, let's see, the ninth adventure in the Kingdom of Fantasy. So, let's do it. I, Geronimo Stilton, was called to the kingdom of fantasy for the ninth time. Blossom, queen of the fairies, had disappeared along with three powerful magic objects. The book of a thousand spells, the crystal sphere, and the whispering wand. If those objects ended up, up with the wrong hands, they could destroy the whole realm. A comp Accompanied by new magical friends, I had to cross. I had to cross horrifying kingdoms full of spiders and snakes, before facing a terrible evil wizard, Squeak. I could not. Could I make it in? It could I make it in time to save Blossom and the entire kingdom of fantasy. Um, I don't know if that book is just my favorite because I read it for the first time or I just liked it a lot. But, yeah, so in my opinion, the first one and the ninth one are the best. But, for now, we have these books. Okay, so these ones, um, I got them for like a small present, but okay, so let's start with the first one, the Phoenix of Destiny. So let's see, this book is probably my second, fa second favorite. Um, but it's very, these new ones are very thick, about 500 and something pages. The end of the pages are gold. Um, I finished the book, but the only reason I have a bookmark there is because there's, the, there's a few books that come with recipes, but this one caught my eye. It's a, a slurpy. It's actually a. They teach you how to make a slurpy. Um, but yeah, I kept the bookmark there, so whenever I wanted to make a slurp, 
it's the sloppy then I can make one. Not okay. So let's go on to the book. So get so let's see what it's about. The adventure of epic proportions. See that says that it doesn't say what number it is on here at all. Okay, let's go. I, Geronimo Stilton, had returned to the kingdom of fantasy on the wings of the Phoenix of Destiny. Blossom Queen of the Fairies needed my help once again. But Blossom was behaving strangely. She sent me off on a quest after a magical... Bleh. Okay, let me just... But Blossom was behaving strangely. She sent me off on a quest after magical quest. Each one was more bizarre and dangerous than the last. It felt it felt like my missions were building up to something truly terrible right under my snout. Could my friends and I put things right again um i think maybe they decided not to make more kingdom of fantasy so they put so much gold here but they actually did so i'm just wondering if they decided to stop here and go on but uh, so now for the last adventure to the kingdom of fantasy. Oh, oh. Um, so first, let me show you the contents at the end. These are all the books that he made. Uh, oh yeah, so th this is the kingdom of fantasy. It says, don't miss any of my adventurous adventures in the kingdom of fantasy so there is one two three there i have those three so these three i have none of these but okay then next row i have wizard's wand over there um yeah so i have all of these only one of these actually phoenix of destiny and two of these dragon of fortune which is this one and the wizard one so now we'll go on the blurb of the dragon of fortune on the part Another adventurous of our epic proportions. I, Geronimo Stilton, revealed, traveled on the, on the wings of the Dragon of Fortune back to the Kingdom of Fantasy. I was called there by my friend Blossom, the queen, queen of the fairies who needed my help. The enchanted winged ring had gone missing. This was terrible news. The ring allows its owner to travel between the kingdom of fantasy and the real world, I which, which could be dangerous power if it fell into evil hands. Could I find the ring before it was too late? This one is not so good, but I I, I liked it when I first read it. But it uh, Phoenix of Destiny is better. I think this one is just about a few pages thicker. But, yeah, so they're both very similar, should I say. So let me turn them around so you can see. So this one here is Order of the Phoenix. I mean, keep on getting mixed up with Harry Potter. Um, This one is... What do you call it? Oh yeah, Phoenix of Destiny. Um, I'll try and bring it up again. So yeah, that the one here is Phoenix of Destiny. 
and this one is the Dragon of Fortune. They both look the same. But anyway, so please subscribe. Let me just put them into a stack. Please subscribe and to this channel and like this video. So yeah, let me know in the comment section if you like it or not. I want to get up to like a thousand likes at least. So I'm done. Oh my God! Is a 